Hey, what's going on everybody? So I just wanted to give a brief uh, overview of the Minolta Rokor, or Roker X 50mm 1.7. Uh, this is something I just picked up last week. It's going to be uh, being used on my new Sony A7 Mark II, which I have not received yet. I'm still waiting on it. I was I pre-ordered it and still waiting. So this is going to be, uh, you know, I was just kind of reading some reviews and, uh, you know, looking for a 50 millimeter and kind of thought about, you know, the 55 millimeter uh, Sony Zeiss lens, uh, 1.8, yeah, 1.8. Um, and I thought, you know, that is a great lens. It's got unbelievable reviews from everybody I've read that 55 millimeter is supposed to be spectacular. Uh, but I, I found a little article about that you could pick this up for cheap. Went on Amazon or, yeah, actually... Uh, I uh, went on eBay, actually. No, it was Amazon. And found this one for like 30 bucks. And I got this adapter off Amazon. It's a Fotoga or Fotga, uh, which is a Minolta mount to Sony NEX or E mount uh, for like 12 bucks. So I decided, what the heck? If it doesn't work out, you know, I can, you know, it's, it was 35, 40 bucks all in. So I can still always go back to the 55 millimeter or even the Loxia 50 millimeter F2, which I'm really excited about. Uh, and so we'll see. But so far, I love the look and feel of this lens. It's very cheap in price, but it feels so much better. I have my, uh, my 50, mm, 50 millimeter 1.8 Canon here, and uh, it just feels so much better in the hands uh, than this 50 millimeter 1.8 from Canon. Um, obviously this is like a hundred bucks to buy. This is 35 to $40 to buy. The difference is you get image, or I'm sorry, you get uh, focus mate, autofocus with this. You do not get autofocus with this one. So it's all manual focus, but the good thing is the focus ring so far feels extremely nice. I mean, it's nothing out of this world, but it feels really nice for the price. And uh, it's just, uh, it feels good. So just want to give you a quick, few looks into the lens. Uh, this is a very clean one. I mean, you know, for 35 bucks or whatever, it's a very clean lens that uh, that I bought here. And I was pretty happy when I, it showed up and there's no dust inside um, that, that I can see. Uh, the lens elements look pristine. I'm not sure exactly when they built this lens. I could probably do some research and find out exactly when it was built. It was probably like the 90s or something, maybe even the 80s, I'm not really sure, but I don't know, whoever uh, bought this lens initially took really good care of it, so I feel pretty happy about that purchase. Um, I don't know the image quality yet, that's something I will follow up and do a review of once I get the new uh, A7 that I'm waiting for, um, but until that time, I'm pretty happy with the look and feel of it, and I guess that's part of the awesomeness, but the true awesomeness is what the image quality is going to look like. Uh, so, if you have any questions, just let me know. Again, this is the Minolta Roker X uh, 50mm f1.7. Thank you very much.